Walk into any coffee shop, library, or office and you'll likely see rows of laptops glowing with the familiar Windows logo. From students finishing assignments to professionals crunching numbers, Windows is everywhere you look. Its blue logo has become almost as recognizable as the coffee cups and books that fill these spaces. It's the world's most popular operating system, powering millions of computers globally. For most people, Windows is the default choice, reliable, user-friendly, and compatible with almost every piece of software you can imagine. It's the backbone of daily digital life for businesses, schools, and homes alike. But there's one place you won't find many Windows machines, a hacker's den. Step into the shadowy world of cybersecurity experts, ethical hackers, or even those operating on the fringes, and you'll notice something different. The familiar Windows logo is conspicuously absent, replaced by cryptic symbols and terminal windows. Why is that? Why do hackers shun this ubiquitous operating system? What makes them turn away from what the rest of the world seems to embrace so readily? The answer lies in the fundamental differences between Windows and its open-source counterpart, Linux. Hackers crave control, flexibility, and anonymity, qualities that Windows, with its closed-source nature and stringent security measures, often lacks. Linux, on the other hand, offers a playground for those who want to tinker, customize, and truly understand what's happening under the hood. This essay will delve into the reasons why hackers avoid Windows like the plague, opting for the power and freedom of Linux. We'll explore how Linux's open-source philosophy aligns with the hacker mindset, and why its flexibility is so appealing to those who live on the digital edge. We'll use clear, simple language to explore the technical and philosophical underpinnings of this preference, unraveling the mysteries of the hacker world. Whether you're a tech enthusiast or just curious, you'll gain insight into the mindset that drives hackers to choose Linux over Windows. So, buckle up as we embark on this enlightening journey, demystifying the hacker's world and understanding why Windows is their least favorite operating system. We'll break down the myths, look at real-world examples and see what truly sets these two systems apart. Along the way we'll uncover the allure of Linux and the tools that make it a hacker's paradise. From specialized distributions to powerful command line utilities, you'll see why Linux is the go-to choice for those who want to push the boundaries of what's possible. Get ready to see the digital world from a whole new perspective, the hacker's perspective. By the end you'll understand, not just what hackers use, but why they make the choices they do, and how those choices shape the digital landscape we all share. One of the primary reasons hackers gravitate towards Linux is its open-source nature. Unlike many other operating systems, Linux is built on the idea that knowledge should be shared, not hidden. This philosophy has shaped the way hackers and cybersecurity professionals approach their craft, giving them a unique playground to experiment, learn, and innovate. But what does open source really mean? It's a term that's thrown around a lot in the tech world, but its implications are profound, especially for those who want to push the boundaries of what's possible with technology. In simple terms, it means the source code, the blueprint of the software, is freely available for anyone to view, modify, and distribute. This openness creates a culture of transparency and trust, where anyone can inspect the code for flaws, suggest improvements, or even build entirely new features. This transparency is a hacker's dream come true. It allows them to understand how the operating system works at its core, identify vulnerabilities, and even create custom tools and modifications. With access to the inner workings of Linux, hackers can experiment freely, test their theories and develop new techniques that would be impossible on a closed system. Windows on the other hand is a closed source system. Its source code is a closely guarded secret, hidden from public view. Only a select few within Microsoft have access to the inner workings of the operating system, making it much harder for outsiders to understand or modify. This lack of transparency makes it difficult for hackers to fully grasp its inner workings, limiting their ability to exploit weaknesses or customize the system to their needs. For those who thrive on curiosity and exploration, this can be incredibly frustrating as it puts up barriers to learning and innovation. Imagine trying to pick a lock without knowing the mechanism. That's the challenge hackers face with closed source systems like Windows. You're left guessing, working in the dark, and often hitting dead ends. In contrast, Linux hands you the schematics, the tools, and the freedom to tinker as much as you want. This open source philosophy extends beyond the operating system itself. Many popular hacking tools are also open source, developed collaboratively by a global community of security researchers and ethical hackers. This means that anyone, anywhere in the world, can contribute to making these tools better, more powerful, and more secure. This collaborative spirit fosters innovation and ensures that the tools are constantly evolving to meet the demands of the cybersecurity landscape. 
New vulnerabilities are discovered, patches are released, and features are added at a rapid pace, all thanks to the collective effort of the community. In contrast, hacking tools designed for Windows are often proprietary and expensive, putting them out of reach for many aspiring hackers. This creates a barrier to entry, making it harder for newcomers to learn and experiment. With Linux and open source tools, the only limit is your curiosity and willingness to learn. Beyond its open source nature, Linux offers another powerful tool that hackers adore, the terminal. This unassuming black window, filled with blinking cursors and streams of text, is where the real magic happens. For many, it's the heart of the hacker's command center, a place where creativity and technical skill come together. This command line interface might seem intimidating to casual computer users accustomed to Windows graphical interface, but for hackers, it's a gateway to unparalleled control and flexibility. The terminal strips away the distractions of icons and menus, letting users interact directly with the system's core. Imagine being able to control every aspect of your computer with just a few lines of code. That's the power of the Linux terminal. Every keystroke can launch a program, manipulate files or even control remote systems across the world. It allows hackers to interact directly with the operating system's core, bypassing the limitations of graphical interfaces. With the terminal, there's no need to wait for slow animations or dig through endless menus. Everything is just a command away. Need to scan a network for vulnerabilities? A single command in the terminal does the trick. Tools like Nmap or Netcat can be launched instantly providing detailed information that would take much longer to gather through a graphical tool. Want to automate a complex hacking task? A simple script can be written and executed in seconds. The terminal supports powerful scripting languages like Bash and Python, allowing hackers to chain together commands and automate repetitive processes with ease. While Windows offers a command prompt, its capabilities pale in comparison to the Linux terminal. The Linux shell is far more versatile, supporting a vast array of commands, utilities, and scripting options that simply aren't available on Windows by default. The Windows command prompt is limited in its functionality, and often requires cumbersome workarounds to accomplish tasks that are straightforward in Linux. Even basic operations can become frustratingly complex, pushing power users to seek alternatives. This limited control makes Windows a less desirable environment for hackers who thrive on the power and precision of the command line. For those who want to push boundaries, Linux is the obvious choice. The Linux terminal is more than just a tool, it's a symbol of the hacker ethos. It represents a mindset that values efficiency, adaptability, and the willingness to learn and experiment. It represents efficiency, mastery, and a deep understanding of how computers work. Every command entered is a testament to the user's knowledge and skill, a direct conversation with the machine. It's a place where complex tasks are simplified, and the impossible becomes possible with the right combination of commands. For hackers, the terminal isn't just a workspace, it's a playground, a laboratory, and a canvas for innovation where the only real limit is imagination. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon to stay ahead in cybersecurity. Check out more videos here to keep your knowledge sharp.